All right, everyone, on to insurance engagements then. Uh, just again, you know, learn this. Learn the things that make up an insurance engagement. And the first thing is that somebody else prepares it. So another party prepares whatever it is that somebody is going to examine. So it's when somebody is responsible for examining um, what another party prepares. And examples of that could be doing a risk assessment for a company, reviewing their internal controls, their system reliabilities, um, the value for money maybe on behalf of other people, and uh, social environmental reports. But notice that uh, you know it's the the auditor, if you like, as an audit is an example of this. But the person who is looking at it doesn't prepare it; they just examine it. Now, when they examine it, they generally are complying with something. So it could be certain standards, okay, that they have to comply with. So they examine it, somebody else prepares it, but when they examine it, they examine it looking at uh, certain standards. So when they examine it, they say, yes, it meets these standards, or no, it doesn't meet those standards. So, as I mentioned, really, here's another party, some directors. Here they are preparing something, a set of accounts. And here's another person, obviously the auditor, who is examining that set of accounts. And in an audit, they're going to give opinion on that set of accounts. But if they're going to give an opinion on it, then they must have something to compare it against, some certain standards. And those standards are normally IFRSs. 